Governor Scott Walker is back on the presidential campaign scene, which includes accepting a possible vice president invitation. NBC 26's Alex Hagan is live in the newsroom with Walker's role. Stacey, Wisconsin's governor hasn't endorsed any of these GOP hopefuls, but these candidates wouldn't mind having his support. Both Marco Rubio. The country is not just changing, but falling behind. And Jeb Bush. When you empower parents. Giving them the power to choose. Appeared to court Wisconsin Governor Scott Walker before debating tonight. Walker has been quiet since dropping out of the race, but now is thrust back in the spotlight, which could give him a shot at VP. If it's a Dr. Carson, for example, I think he's going to want to have somebody on the ticket with him who's experienced. The candidates will also look for Walker's endorsement. Rubio's campaign has said they would love his support. I know I can fix it. And according to the New York Times, Bush has said he'd love to have Walker's support as well. How much of a big impact will it have? Certainly can't hurt because he was a kind of a darling of the Republican Party when he first came out. So I'm guessing it will help. I just can't measure the extent of that help. But Wisconsin's governor remains quiet on who he supports. Now, Walker has said he has no interest in a cabinet position, at least at this time. Reporting live tonight in the Green Bay Newsroom, I'm Alex Hagan with NBC26.